I thought it was really disappointing. I, there were some like new features that are kind of interesting, maybe kind of a bit. You know, there, there's some new stuff, but it's not like revolutionary. I didn't, I didn't come away thinking. Maybe that, maybe my expectations were set too high, but I didn't come away thinking, "Wow, this is going to enable a whole new world of things that I couldn't imagine before I went in today." Big thing for me, I was looking for something out of Apple TV. And I really love to do an on-screen presence for some of our applications. We do a second screen app, so you know you're watching your television, you're watching your sport. We've got stuff going on there for your sport. Would have been really, really nice to be able to actually get it up there on the screen. Uh, there's a lot of really new stuff coming out from you know the hardware. It's really exciting. Laptops have been you know long and cute. A lot of people waiting around to get them. But I think the the real news has been the uh, the iPhone SDK stuff and the uh, integration with some of the uh, core iOS technologies back into the Mac. We're not really surprised by a lot of the new developments. I think there was a lot of talk about new computers. Um, we got those. There was talk about um, the new operating system. We got that. And obviously, it seemed like there was the most focus and speculation around um, the new version of iOS. So we have iOS 6, and there are a lot of interesting aspects to it, but it seems to us like the most dramatic kind of improvements or focus really were around three areas. Um, one is the notion of, uh, of Siri, just trying to kind of broaden that out in terms of languages and provide deeper content. Um, two was the notion of integration with Facebook. That's obviously been widely talked about for, it seems like, the last couple of days, if not weeks. And then most significantly, we think, um, new mapping offerings. So you're going to have the ability to not only uh, be able to have turn-by-turn -turn directions with proprietary Apple Maps, but apparently they're integrating Siri, so you're actually going to be able to um, have a two-way conversation uh, with your so-called um, navigation device, which is interesting.